Hello there, this is Siv. Welcome back to the Castle of Craft Artistry. Nowadays, many of us are either working or studying from home. So having a table organizer would be very helpful. Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make four different types of table organizers, which are so easy and fun to make. To make these cute cup holders, you will need Start by painting one or two coats of white acrylic or oil paint over the plastic cup. Here I am using an empty ice cream cup and let it dry completely before moving on to the next coat else the paint may start to come off. Once it dries completely, we can move on to the colouring process. Here I am going to paint two coats of pink acrylic paint. It looks nice as it is, but to make it look cute, here I'm gonna draw eyes and mark with a pencil. Then fill them up with some black acrylic paint. I'm also adding in some dot inside the eyes and blushes using acrylic paint. With that, the cute looking holders are done. You can pop in anything you want. For the next one, you will need To start off, you will need a square sheet of paper. Here I have taken a 10 into 10 inches of pattern paper. First you need to fold the paper into half diagonally. You will get a triangular shape. Then take one end of the triangle and match it to the top of the triangle and fold it down. Do the same for the other side. Open them, then take the top one and match it with the line and fold it down. With that, you are done. You will need two more like this one. You have to join them like how I do to make it look like a box. You can also stick the bottom of the box using glue which is completely optional. With that the cool looking organizer is done. Here I have dropped in a sanitizer which has become the most essential thing to be on your table. You can also drop in your wallet, watch, pretty much everything. For the third DIY you will need Here I have taken a 27 into 27 cm of chart or you can also use origami papers. Divide the chart into 3 equal parts each at 9 cm. Fold along the lines. Then fold them into half. Now fold one of the ends like this and then open it and press it down matching the line at the bottom. Repeat the same for the other one. Flip it over and fold off the sides. Now following this creased line, open it and press it down. Repeat the same for the other.
you will get the same foldings on both the sides. Now take this corner and fold it along this line. Lock it inside the pocket by folding backward. Repeat the same on the other side. Then take the top portion and fold it matching these two corners. Now do the same thing in the other side. Then open it and along this line push it inward and press it down. Repeat it on the other side. Now you will end up with the pocket. You will need few more like this. Now let me show you how to connect them together. Take two pieces and using the flap insert it in the pocket here. And then push this flap into the black one. Likewise you have to do for the rest of the pieces. It is optional that you can also apply glue onto the flap and insert them in the pockets. With that, your portable desk organizer is done. For the final DIY, you will need Here I have taken 8 into 8 inches of paper. Start by folding the paper into half. Further fold the sides into half. You will get 4 divisions. Now rotate the paper and fold it into half. And again fold the sides into half. You will end up with the grid patterns on the sheet. Now fold all the 4 corners diagonally. Then fold the sides in. Fold both the sides like this and also in the middle. Then push one of the end inside the another. You will end up with a triangular shape. You will need 5 more like this to make the complete paint stand. You need to apply glue to the sides and stick them together like this. Put a band around them to give it an extra support. To make the base for the pen stand, you will need another sheet of paper. Place the pen stand over it and mark the corners. And match the markings using a scale. You will get an hexagon. Now draw lines parallel to the hexagon on all the sides. Cut that out. Also cut the corners a little like this. and fold along the flaps. Apply glue to the flaps and stick that to the bottom of the pen stand. With that the pen stand is ready.
I hope these organizers will make your space organized. If you found this tutorial helpful, then make sure to like, share and subscribe. Also don't forget to comment which organizer is your favorite. If you give it a try, do share the pictures with me on Instagram. I have left the link in the description. That would be so awesome. I hope you are doing great. Catch you in my next one. Stay safe. Share love.